First pitcher is a very good hitter, as that is right up the middle for a base hit, a leadoff single for North Florida off of Jack Mahoney. And that's going to be a single into center field. Holding at second is Byers. So back-to-back -back base hits for North Florida to get this game underway against Jack Mahoney and the Gamecocks. 3-2. Not there. It's ball four, and it's Jack Mahoney loading the bases now in the state of Florida. That ball is driven into left field. Left fielder makes the catch, Noah Myers, and a run will come home as tagging from third is Isaiah Byers. It's one to nothing, North Florida. That's going to get over Wimmer, the second baseman. Center fielder Brady Allen is there. So the bases are loaded. It's my best pitch today. He's going to have to find something, and he found the sinker right there. That's maybe not a double play ball, but a good pitch there. That's that late sink that we've got used to seeing. And unfortunately, it was such a good one that that ball was hit very slow. Gilreath delivers the 2-1. Rolled over to second, where Wimmer will handle it over to David Mendham for the final out of the first. But has. Wimmer drives that ball deep center field. Center fielder going back, and that's out of here. A solo jack for Braylon Wimmer to give South Carolina a run as he just blasted that to the batter's eye, deepest part of this ballpark. Braylon Wimmer launching his eighth home run of the season. That's the fourth home run of the year given up by Dylan Kelly. Boy, he put that number high and let her, let her high rather, and boy, did Wimmer just get around on that. Here's the 3 2. Allen lays off, and he'll draw the walk and will head to first. I think he's done a good job, obviously. Wes Clark, see you later. Bye bye. Wes Clark takes that to left for his 17th homer of the year, and he is no longer tied for second in the country. He's there all by himself, as he has one more than Fabian and Young now. And we're tied here in Columbia. Two to two, just like that. Two solos, or rather South Carolina, but the lead three to two is the solo homer from Braylon Ray. So he's not pitching, he's still playing as he's as well. Chance for two, Khalil to Wimmer to Mendham, and there it is, the 6-4-3 double play for South Carolina. And Khalil will go to first. As That's going to be a single in the center field for Noah Myers. So the Gamecocks with two on now, nobody out. Not to knock Wes Clark at all. He, there's a throw to third. Khalil's going to slide in safely. And moving up to second is Noah Myers. So the game comes. That is wrapped into center field. Scoring is Khalil coming around. And sliding in safely is Noah Myers. The decision to run the double steal. Boy, did it work out well for Mark Kingston and the Gamecocks because Myers with his speed was able to come in from second to score in South Carolina. Getting a big hit there from Colin Burgess to bring home two. The Gamecocks lead five to two. We see Noah Myers right there, goes back. He's freezing on the line draft, he goes back. But the most important thing he did was he turned his whole body. His head's on a swivel, he turned his body, he faked. And Wes Clark will send that into left. That's going to get close to the line, and that will put Burgess at third and Clark standing up at second. Good piece of two-out hitting for Wes Clark. And Eister is called out on strikes. To short, Khalil. Throw over is high. Mendham. Making the catch, trying to lay down the tag, but safe at first. Enrolling at North Florida. Comebacker to Gilreath. He'll go to short 
who's covering second, and then Khalil will make the throw over. It's another double play for South Carolina. Oh, that was funny. And he would do it with no shirt on, right? <laughs> of course. And it's driven into center field for a leadoff hit. Off the bat of Blake Maribel. Grounded into a fielder's choice. Runner going. Burgess that just got out of his hand in an awkward way as that goes into right field. They're at the corners now as Sweat walks. The 0-1 is going to be slashed into left. So the run comes in. Blake Maribel, who stole second and then reached third on the throwing error by the Gamecock catcher, Colin Burgess. He'll be able to handle it. Charging from third is Satterfield. Good play by Joe Satterfield, the third baseman, to make that play in a lot this season. Just getting his second start of the year, and he will take his base as that. Diving play by Wimmer to keep it in the infield. The run will come in. Bases remain loaded. Heidi. Ground ball into center field. One run is in, rounding third and heading for home and scoring. UNF will take the lead back on South Carolina as they have put four on the board against the Gamecocks here in the fourth. Big two strike, two out hit. And two RBIs off the bat of Alex Cashler. And here comes Cleanup batter Cade Westbrook, the ninth batter of this inning for North Florida. Mendham, underhand toss to Lloyd, who gets to the bag before Westbrook, and that's the final. He already answered it for you. Probably. That's fair. That is going to be a fair ball for Ricky Presno and he is going to gun for second, and he will get there standing up. I, I, I can't remember, but I just remember in 2000 at South Carolina, we were 25 and 5, and I, I, I thought that record would never get broken. But 3 2 to Clark, and Clark will take his base as he walks. Stops head. He'll take his base, however. But what a battle there by Kilfoyle to come back and get the strikeout. Ground ball short, and Sweat cannot hang on to it. Aiden Sweat. Andrew Eister will get that over the head of the shortstop, so runners at first and second with one out. And Madonna takes care. Catcher's interference. Oh, you're right, indeed. Sino, good call They're there, ask Kip, for a replay also by on Jason that. Johnson. And George Khalil comes through. The tying run is in, and here comes the go-ahead. South Carolina has the lead back at seven to six, with two outs. George Khalil. A two RBI single in the center field, scoring Clark and Eister. How big was the catcher's interference call? Madonna should have been out of this inning with no run scored, but instead he gives up the two RBI single. And how many? 2-2, two -two. swing and a miss, he gets Myers, nine hole. Pound flies that ball deep right field. Right fielder going back to the wall. What a catch. Andrew Eister with a great catch to rob extra bases from Pound, the pinch hitter. We love about Andrew Eister is he just stays so even keeled as well. High fly ball. Deep left fielder Noah Myers is there. Just a step before the track. Alex Cashler, their best hitter, is on deck. And Bosnick dials up the pitch he needed. 
and he gets the strikeout to end the ball game. A come from behind win for the Gamecocks.